Yo, what is up, beautiful people? Welcome back to a brand new video. Today's video is going to be episode number four of the RuneScape's Hardest Challenge. If you're unfamiliar with the episode, there's going to be a playlist in the description and in the pinned comment, and you can watch the series from the beginning and uh, see the explanation as well. But uh, long story short, we try to complete collection log. And with that being said, let's jump right into the video. So I did a little of buying and selling on the Grand Exchange and I sold my claws, bought the lands and just so I can do the dragon task said, can we just all appreciate the animation that you do when you're running with this thing? Look at it. It is weird, but awesome. So I have these Kelly Wyverns right now. I just want to test the lands out. I don't even know if the Wyverns are considered to be dragons. I'm pretty sure they are, but you know, I'm pretty dumb. So I'm too lazy to look it up. But look at it. Look how I run. It, it is hilarious. Let's see how this uh, thing hits though. Dude, it looks like the attack animation looks beautiful. Look at it. It is so like not old school like, but it is so beautiful at the same time. And holy fuck, I'm literally shredding these. This is officially the first time I'm stuck and I'm actually asking Lemon Lime to come save me. So I'm in 42 wilderness. I caught my lava ill for, for the diary. The web was already slashed when I ran in. I forgot my knife. I caught my eel, got the task done, and I cannot go out. So now I'm trying for these black knights to kill me, but uh, Lemon Lime's coming through to save me with his knife. So, uh, yeah, I actually got outplayed by wilderness, I guess. It has been a while, but I started doing my daily farm runs again, which is awesome. And there it is, 90 farming coming through. We can now do redwood trees without boosts. Very convenient. Uh, I'll plant a new one in a moment. Uh, but yeah, I'm going for 99 farming, obviously. Still want to get that pet as well. All right, so we killed another Hespori, and uh, that was the KC number three. And we got ourselves a new pair of seed which is an addition to the collection log. So we got ourselves two Iasori seeds. Not bad. Um, I just sold those white lilies for 450k. That's what we call profit. What the fuck? So the next few clips are going to be post commentary simply because uh, all those clips were recorded on a different computer. But as you can see, I was doing some Hydra, uh, two times one million loot there for a couple from a couple of trips. And the whole idea was to just continue doing more Slayer. And um, the only Slayer tasks I do are the ones that I can get uh, new drops for my collection log. So I am doing Drakes, I am doing Worms and I am doing Hydras, obviously. So in order to complete all of those, I have to do Konar Slayer. I also got 96 Slayer in the process, so we're now just three levels away from that beautiful 99. And uh, here we get 180 Wyrms or 179 Wyrms, and we got ourselves a nice little Runite uh, or drop as well. Uh, it's a rare Konar drop, table drop. Um, and we're closing in here on uh, the amount of clips we have from a different place. We got ourselves a Kraken that uh, we will do later on in the video. Um, and here we can see that we got pretty lucky with the farm contracts I'm doing those every single day and here I was lucky enough to get four of them in a row so uh, you actually make decent profit from just opening these and just planting stuff and uh, farming thanks to farming guild is actually super enjoyable for me um, I'm really really enjoying farming recently so that's definitely gonna be one of the next 99s on this account and I'm really looking forward to it and um, Right now I kind of have a schedule, a routine, I do my full farming run and everything every single morning and it's actually really really nice. And as you can see I got a couple of seeds, um, the new ones being Kronos, Iasori and Atas, uh, they all have their difference uh, bonus effects so they're pretty nice. And then after that I decided to do a little bit of the Winter Toad, uh, we got ourselves um, warm gloves and in over 200 Winter Toad chests I actually still have not received a single Pyromancer outfit. Uh, I'm currently 91 fire making actually, and I still have not received a single piece of outfit, which is random. Um, and here we have a clip from my regular Iron Man that I still play on the side very frequently, and uh, we got 93 rune crafting there. But a cool thing though, we don't have Pyromancer's pieces, but we did get ourselves a Tome of Fire, which is very, very rare. And that's a new thing on the collection log, as you're able to see. Uh, check in the winter thought, look, 187 KC, not a single Pyromancer piece. Um, however, 
here we are probably going to be getting a level 90 fire making coming through and no now we go back to live commentary and here we go continuing my morning routine just doing farming and 91 farming accomplished we can now plant two spirit trees which is very very nice and um yeah, the reason I haven't been playing much of RuneScape lately is actually because there's a new uh, League of Legends season out and I'm kind of playing that a little bit more right now. If you're interested in League and whatnot, I do have a second channel where I will upload more frequently. So feel free to check that out if you're interested in what I do outside of RuneScape. However, um, uh, after I'm done with this fire making to 99, I will be very close to 2.2k total and I think my next one's gonna be Hunter because it's currently by far my lowest skill and it's actually not that bad uh, I have it like 90 plus on my Iron Man already and I think I can push it to 99 just doing um, black chains in the wilderness and do some anti PKing there so I think I can make it a ton of fun um, but yeah I'm just gonna finish this farm run right here and then uh, probably return to Winterton Another has Pori defeated, defeated, this is how I usually end my farming runs and let's see what do we get, we got ourselves some Quarm and an Atas seed, uh, so nothing new unfortunately, that's KC number 4, beautiful, I think I have a Kraken task on this account, so I'm gonna go ahead, gear up and do, oh actually, now nah, let's do more winter Winterton, let's do more winter Winterton. And the pop-up message didn't really happen because of a supply crate drop, but we are now 91 farm making 600k experience off. And believe it or not, still not a single Pyromancer piece. We have the gloves, but they are just a cosmetic, they don't really help towards the XP, but not a single piece. We got a bunch of pages, we got a tome, um, I think we even got an axe at some point, but I don't think it uh, shows on the collection log. Uh, but we never actually got ourselves a single Pyromancer piece. Let me show you quickly that. Um, so if we look into the collection log, I think it's right. Where do I have it? Here. Um, look at this. Boom. Read bosses winter Todd. This, this one didn't even show as well. Dude, I have a feeling like I once had a full Pyromancer, but I just don't have it. It must have been a different account. It must have been. Uh, anyways, 212kc, not a single piece. Um, feels bad, man, I guess. Alright, so, I stopped at about 400k away from 92 fire making, and what I'm gonna do right now is I'm gonna catch some black chins. However, the first things first is I wanna sell some of the stuff in my bank to buy an armadillo crossbow, because I wanna anti-PK at chins. I think I can make it interesting if I do it like that. So, we're gonna be selling our loot tab again, some runes and whatnot, and we're gonna see how much... Yeah, well, I guess we're gonna make like 5 mil and then we're gonna sell some other stuff and uh, have enough for an armadillo crossbow, that's the plan and then we're gonna end TPK a little bit Admin mode, I think a lot of people would watch Please attack me, please attack me, yes, let's go Boys, we have content See ya, bro. Thanks for the loot, my guy. <laughs> this guy was PKing for the first time. <laughs> oh, I fucking love this game. What else do we even pick up? Alright, nice. First kill. Looting bang? Uh, yeah, uh, that's one thing I forgot. But yo, let's price check that, man. That is a kill and a half. So we got 200 chins, 700k, not bad. A this thingy. Obviously, the loot is not gonna be special. This man was PKing with an amulet of strength. Uh, but I mean, I'll take it. 900k trip, beautiful. <laughs> Wait, why'd you clip that, dude? You don't get. You... Wait, let's see. I accidentally <laughs> fucked my teammate's mom after he ran it down mid seven times. So we are now chat restricted zero on our. <laughs> I, accident I accidentally fucked my teammate's mom after he ran it down mid seven times. So we are now chat restricted zero on our. I accidentally <laughs> fucked my teammate's mom after he ran it down mid seven times. <laughs> so we are now chat restricted so zero on our. I accidentally fucked my teammate's mom after he ran it down mid seven times. <laughs> so we are now chat restricted zero on our. I accidentally fucked my teammate's mom after he ran it down mid seven times. That should be my new sub sub, dude. Just this part. I accidentally fucked my teammate's mom after he ran it down <laughs> mid seven times. 
<laughs> Imagine, dude. Fucking banned from Twitch in like a week. So we are now chat restricted, zero honor. I accidentally fucked my teammate's no, mom fuck. after God he- No, fuck! Goddamn, now I even missed my hunter level. Alright, anyways, ladies and gentlemen, we just achieved level 81 hunter, which is beautiful. Um, just keep hunting here. And, um, the little thing I'm doing right now, I'm hiding my chins in the looting bag. So every 50, I just throw them in there. So I have absolutely no idea how many I have in here. Um, but hopefully we don't attract PKers on livestream if we do so. And, uh, we also got one kill so far. Uh, which is pretty good, and I'm enjoying this. We're getting very close to 2.2k total, so uh, I think I want to get to around 90 Hunter as fast as possible, just so I have, what, like, base 90 stats? I think that would look pretty cool on the account. Okay, another trip done. We have 25 chins in the inventory, and the cheeky little 247 right here. So another meal in the looting bag, and uh, a little bit of money here, so that is very good. And we're closing in on 82 Hunter almost, so it's looking really good. Please die. Spec? Oh, are you kidding me? No way! I'm so sad right now. You cannot make this shit up, dude. One on that HP. I need to accept this. How is he still alive? This is so depressing. You must be kidding me, I'm so pissed. Oh. I know I'm lucky, hey, it's all good, dude. Oh my god, I cannot hit him! He's gonna AGS me and I'm gonna die. I already know it, dude, it's the worst. Fuck, I need to eat. Just gonna heal? It's all good, man. And there it is, man. Good fight. Alright, let's see the loot of this trip. 1.4 mil. Not bad. Not bad. I've been waiting for this one for a bit. I don't really know why I haven't done it, but Spirit Tree and Fairy Ring in the house, and I need a watering can. What is this shit? Alright, well, let's get a watering can. Alright, round number two, we got ourselves a watering can. Can I make it this time? Uh, boom. And outside of this, I have everything in the house that I want. I will still want to get the portal chamber room thingy though. So, if I quickly do this one. Beautiful, that's what we want. And uh, this one will be there forever. And I kind of want to build, just build for now, a... Um, where is it? A portal nexus room. Okay, it does have doors. That's what I wanted to know because I want to remove this one because I don't use this glory ever because I have it in the ornate jewelry box. So we're going to do a quick little viewer. And uh, this is the one I think. We're going to move this one here. Done. And I'm not actually going to build a portal nexus fully yet just because... It's kind of a waste of money at the moment for me, and I don't really have too much money to spend. However, there's two teleports on this thing, thing that are super, super useful, and I want to build those. So if we build that, we can still access all of our teleports perfectly fine, and we can also build a Xerishian talisman and mounted uh, dig side pendant. Let's do that now, and that's going to help with all sorts of teleportation around the game. How do I get a medallion? Mate, how do I get a medallion? What? I forgot a dick side pendant. Loot. Alright, there we go. Round two. Medallion, please. Exchange rubies. Thank you. Alright, now we should be able to go to the house and build both things. And uh, it's gonna be awesome because now I will never use charges to teleport around anymore. Um, so we go building mode. And I'll worry about the Nexus portal at some later stages in this account. Don't really wanna invest my money into it at the very moment. So we're gonna put this one right here. And we're going to put the other one right here. So this is going to be awesome. 
And as you can see, it's basically just infinite, uh, infinite uh, Xeric, infinite dig site pendant. Gonna help me with the farm runs. Speaking of farm runs, let's complete a farm run. Doing Kraken at the moment, 850k from this trip. We still need to get Trident and the pet to complete the log from Kraken. So not too bad. And I really do enjoy that boss to be completely honest. So let's just go for another trip. 1 million from the next trip and we have also done the task. We're still taking Konar tasks just because we want to get the Hydra. And we get Thermonuclear Smoke Devil. It would probably be smart to do 35 of them, I would assume, but I want to just do... Th what happens now? Do I just talk to her again or something? What? I, I lost my barrier points. Oh, there we go. How many would I like to slay? 3 or 35. Chan, do we do 35 or do we do 3? Smoke Devils in the Smoke Devil Dungeon. Wait, Smoke Dust. I could kill boss, honestly, but... Hmm. I mean, I'm already geared up to do it. Let's do a little bit of bossing. And then I can always end it just barraging. Alright, so that's gonna be everything I have for today. First of all, I'd like to say a small little sorry, because I have been away for a week. Um, but now the videos are gonna come back full speed and uh, I have hardcore Iron Man planned, I have Iron Man videos planned and the main videos planned, PKing planned, everything is planned. It's gonna be great. So if you enjoy RuneScape stuff and if you're not yet subscribed, now is the time to sub. Uh, we're basically almost 56,000 subs, which is kind of crazy. Uh, that amount of people is really, really epic. Um, however, before I end the video, I would like to ask for a small little favor. If you guys do enjoy other games outside of RuneScape, particularly League of Legends, I do have a second channel uh, where I upload almost every single day. So, I mean, if that's something you want to look into or whatever, give it a watch, give it a sub, give it a like or whatever. Check out my second channel. I'm currently trying to get to the point where I can monetize that channel. I need 4,000 watch time minutes or whatever. So you can help me out by, I guess, watching some videos there. At the moment, the videos only get like 200, 300 views per video, but uh, it's very informative, high level League of Legends content and other games. That On that channel, I will post anything and everything I want. So I really do hope you guys show some support to that channel as well. With all that being said, I really do hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'll be back very soon with the hardcore progress. So I'm really excited to see what you guys will think about that. But with all that being said, I'm now going to say goodbye. Thank you for watching and I'll see you very soon. Bye-bye.